Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Stealing 33 Plays Flint Hook. My name is Stealing 33, and today, ladies and gentlemen, what the hell is this? The Infinity Raid. In this mode, hunt for treasure across infinite stages. Your adventures last as long as you can stay alive. Well, that's, uh, that's something we'll get to later. But for right now, let's fight Baron Von Goo. It opens the packs. Tick tock on the clock. Fling Hook. Ahoy, your mighty quick hook reaches further. That actually might be kind of useful. Sharpshooter. Get even better chances of hitting critical blasts. And the Midas Challenge. Boo Boo Begone! Healing items get a bit more effective. Good news! Alright. Not bad. We gotta buy more um, perk slots. They're just really expensive, is the issue. Yeah. I, like, and I kinda I like the setup we have right now, for all things considered. Got fucking skulls coming out of the back of our head. Let's get started. Let's uh, let's dive into it. What we got here? Labyrinth, Flyax Infestation, Gamblinger, Lockdown, Labyrinth, Platoon. Just a platoon. Uh, I think we're just going to go with the vanilla platoon. Uh, just because I, you know, got to get warmed up. Got to get into it, you know? And we got a long road ahead of us. Uh, there's, uh, we got to get like five ghost gems or some shit. I, don't, I, I wasn't paying attention, to be honest. Um, I mean, if the trend continues, I think it might be four or five. I don't remember how much the last guy needed. It might have been five. I don't know. We'll find out at the end of the level. All right. Let's uh, reacclimate myself to the flint hook lifestyle here. Oh, well, this is a this is a great room. Oh. No. I wonder if that contact damage counts. I'm uncertain. Nope, didn't count. All right, cool. Let's do it. Let's go. Unless I, unless I bought the, um, I don't remember if I bought the, uh, what's it called? The time trial one yet. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, right now I'm in, oh, this is hell. This is hell. I'm gonna have to come back through this fucking room. Like. That's the real nightmare here. All right. He does it. We're doing fine. Oh, no. I fell in the fucking acid. Okay, so the falling in the traps doesn't count towards my... Ow. Flawless. By getting hit by the bad guy does. Got it. Got it. Good to know. Good to know. Bomb's great. Happy to have it. Should have equipped that thing to let my hook reach further, apparently. Alright. Easy does it. Got all of our shit. Well, we got a bunch of gold at least. Cool. Ooh, we're hemorrhaging HP pretty badly though, to be honest. There we go. Hopefully we'll find some food soon. Excuse me, ghosts. Get away. I don't like these ghosts, man. They're big, they're huge dicks. Perfect. All right, let's get out of here. This room could politely uh, suck on my knob. Easy does it. Yeah, I'm enjoying. You know, I uh, I was talking to Eric about this yesterday while we were recording um, uh, Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. Which, if you're not watching that series, look forward to a couple episodes with Eric later this week that are actually, like, super choice. And hilarious. I thought they were pretty good. I mean, you know, your mileage may vary. I'm not you. They're definitely content that I would watch. Like, just, like, by myself. <laughs> um, and I'm not just saying that because I made it. Like, legit, actually think it's pretty good. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, we were, we were talking about, um... Flint Hook and about, uh... 
He was playing. He's been playing. Um, uh, what's it called? Warhammer. Uh, Dawn of War 3, which, uh, you know, we're still not sold. We have to get five fucking ghost gems. Mm. That's gonna be a nightmare. Let's go! Woo! This is gonna take a while. Hope you guys are buckled up, because, uh, if each level takes me an average of five minutes, it's gonna be a half hour episode. Let's go! Let's do it! I'm excited. Where's. Where did I throw my phone? Where's my phone so I use my phone for a timer, so uh, I, uh, I need to keep it on hand. Let's me know how long we've been running here. Treasurium and Asphyxia, Rumble Room, Devil's Lodge, Fogful, Tough Troops, Devil's Lodge, and Gamblinger. We're gonna go with the Treasurium and Asphyxia. I feel like um, the Treasurium by itself might be worth it, but then uh, Asphyxia is bad, like really bad. But I feel like it's not. Like, there are worse ones we can get, and I don't know, how, like, what Tough Troops... I feel like Tough Troops is the kind of thing that's going to be, like, it's a bunch of elite enemies, and... I'm going to be straight. That doesn't sound like a good time to me. Right, there we go. Easy. Super easy. Get the treasure and let's get out of here. Yeah. Remember, we're in a rush. So we're not, like, we're not here to explore. We're actually just here to get in, get out, and get on with our lives. Ah, oh, goddammit. Could have just shot up and killed that guy, but no. I had to try to run at the axe guy. I actually think hooking that guy's bubble might have saved my saved me from taking damage. Which I then I took anyway, but the, the point stands. What do we got? A key? Cool. Let's get out of here. God, no, a lot of a lot of rumble rooms here. To be honest, I was not expecting this. So hooking that hook actually killed. Got me. That's a. Uh, that's an issue. Got to work on that. Up. 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 There we go. And we made it. Nice. Easy. Got it. Down, up, down. I, I, I hit down. It wouldn't let me go down. I'm going bullshit. Game, game's rigged. Get out of here, bird. Get out of here, pukey bird. I feel like we should go back for the other treasures. But at the same time, like, we just got, we got no time. Definitely buy a perk. Definitely buy space meat. I'm not gonna bother buying the armor. I'm just gonna lose it. Like when I come down into this room, Frost Globe. We just got this. From its description, it sounds like it freezes everybody on a room. Which might actually be like super worth the time investment. Oh, that was a dumb room. I hated that. Oh God. Oh Lord. Oh, come off of it, game. Doing our fighting game. Yeah, I saw the secret room. What of it? Got a little bit of armor. A free bomb if we wanted it. I don't want it because I have a frost globe, but I feel like the frost globe's better. The bomb is good. It does a lot of damage, but, um... I hated that. I hated that. The whole thing about that was awful. Apple. Meat. Out. You know, it, it hurts my, like, sense of self to be buying uh, health in a game like this. Because, like, in Gungeon, it's a bad idea, right? Like, in Gungeon, it's just a waste of money to buy health. Unless you're going to die, it's a waste of money, right? 
But in this game, I feel like we're in a situation where, like, it's important to future-proof yourself rather than, like, live in the moment. And, like, you know, living in the moment would be, like... Living in the moment would be... Oh, are you kidding me? Wow, that's, this dude's uh, tanky as balls, man. Tanky as balls. Take the bomb. I'm surprised. Yeah, I thought we did more damage than that, but I guess not. Right, yeah, we out. I see no reason to stick around longer than we have to. Smash, smash, smash. Let's go. It. Let's get out. Let's get on. I want to be the best. I, this, the clock's still ticking, by the way. So, like, if you were, like, almost barely didn't have enough time, you'd still fucking die. You gotta give yourself at least ten seconds to do that whole animation. Which means you have to enter that room with, like, fifteen seconds, because it takes a second to, like, break that shell, and then you have to do all the animations and garbage. Chopping block and the larder. Battalion on board. The twirling territory. Doom sanctuary. Poison Countdown, Labyrinthing. We're going to do this one. I don't know what a chopping block is. I think that might be that curse that, like, the headsman guy gave me. Where he, like, cut my HP down, but gave me a damage boost, I think, was, like, what it was. I, I don't remember. It was a couple episodes ago now. Or was it last episode? I don't know, man. Got a real bad memory for this kind of thing, to be honest. This room sucks. I thought this was maybe, perhaps. Well, I mean, we got hit once or twice out of that. It's uh, kind of whatever, I guess, but... Uh, that's health, and I don't know what that one is, but we need health, so we're going to take the health. Without the meal, there is no heal. I don't like the noise, so they make like an ending noise that like clips the hell out of my my headphones when it plays. I don't like it. Look at this fucking nightmare zone. Ow! Fell in the fire. Fell like directly into the fire. Right, easy, does it? We got time. There's no reason for us to rush. Let's just kill them at our pace and you good to go. Got all the treasure in the universe here. I jumped. Game. Okay. I don't appreciate your fucking blasphemy against my jumping. I was like, I thought I saw something moving up there, but... Didn't quite get a glimpse of it, and then it was a fly axe. Ow. Just go up the thing. There you go. There you go. Okay, we got a key. Let's go down. Uh, headsman's block. I'm pretty sure this will kill me if I touch it, so let's not touch it. We will come back for it, because I'm not going to shy away from it. Just because it makes the game slightly harder, I'm not going to shy away from it, but... Ugh. <sighs> Perfect world. We would have touched it immediately, but. Get out of here. Oh, hi. Get out of here. Oh, get the gold. Got it. Cool. Got another key. We got two keys now. Oh, I mean, this isn't where I wanted to go. But yet, here we are. Cool. Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. Easy peasy. All right. I feel like playing Flint Hook so much has also, like, Im greatly improved my ability to aim on PC, by the way. Just, like, for the record. 
Um, just because, like, it's made my mouse, like, I'm, I got a lot better visual acuity now when it comes to, like, aiming on the computer, which I did not have before. I've always been really bad at it, and, um, all the player unknowns Battlegrounds and all the Flint Hook I've been playing has really, like, enhanced my ability to, like, aim and stuff. Ow, touch the ghost. Oops. Alright, so I can either activate hooks or I can activate platforms. Got it. Let's, uh... Fucking... Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh no. Just kill that guy, please. Well, I got roasted, so we're not going back for the headsman, apparently. I'm just gonna get out while I still can. We got fucking roasted during this whole, this whole debacle. Woo! Yeah, we took a lot of damage. We went from 120 to 50. I'm glad we bought that tonic, because we'd be dead, but, um... Shit. Yeah, we're in a, we're in a bad way right now. I, like, want to go to all the rooms, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die if I, um... But, uh, you know... We gotta do what we gotta do to survive here. I wanna at least make it to the boss fight. Because I got I got no idea what the fuck is gonna be up with this boss. For all I know, it's gonna be like super hard. Heavy and slow, gamblinger, rough raiders, lockdown, platoon on board. Cornucopia. Alright, let's go let's go to this one. Cornucopia sounds like a place we can get food. So, uh I'm on board with the I'm on board with that healing, I'll tell you that. Let's fucking go. Yeet! Let's go. All right. What do we got? Let's go down. Hmm. Oh, this is a nightmare. Oh, this is a nightmare. Nightmare zone. Nightmare room. I hate these octopuses. Oh, those are rockets. I was expecting shots. I got all excited that this room was going to be fairly easy. Shows what I fucking know. Oh, are you kidding me? I got hit by that? Fine game. I guess we'll play it by your rules. You dick. Right. Got the thing. Let's go this way. We got to find that cornucopia room. Again, just going well for the name, it sounds like the kind of thing that, like, is going to save our lives right now. Got it. Kill, kill, kill. Oh, God. Ghost Man is a fucking nightmare. Down. Across. Up. Kill Bubble Man. Bubble Man, ironically, actually a very scary villain for Mega Man. Uh, dude's uh, in the NT Warrior series is actually like... Well, I mean, he's still kind of an idiot in the NT Warrior series, but... The Headsman's chopping block, huh? Fuck it, go for it. What do we got? The Phoenix! If we die, we come back to life. That's actually going to be very useful, probably. Took a little bit of our HP, but you know, it didn't reduce us below 100, so uh, I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it A-OK -okay for right now. Apparently, missiles can pass through uh, solid objects. Oh, okay. Good to know, I guess. Get out of here. Oh. Well. That room turned out to not be that hard to pass through, but, well, that's a good thing, because it's going to be very painful to pass back through. We don't have quite enough for Pirate's Pep, and I don't think there's any way for us to get it from this room. But we're back to full HP, and we got a thing that makes healing items better, so... Now, to be honest, without the missile guy in this room, that room's actually not that bad. This room, on the other hand, is a, is a douchebag. Uh, tonic and uh, another potion. If we really, if we needed to heal, uh, you know what? I, 
I was right, at least. The Cornucopia seems to be the place to go when you need healing. All right, Treasure Man. Let's go. That worked out better than I expected, to be honest. Are you kidding me? That guy didn't die. Oh, oh my God! Stop it! Blew myself up. Oh my God! I'm gonna get fucking roasted. Oh, I'm gonna get roasted. Yep. That's it. I just died once. Oh, there we go. Yep, there it goes. There it goes. Should have saved my fucking bombs. Ah, damn. Oh, well. We really tried. We tried real hard there. Uh, but that is going to do it for this episode, unfortunately. So thank you all so much for watching. If you guys like what you saw, let me know. If you guys want to see more, don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date on when I post more videos. If you really like what you saw, leave a like. Helps the channel grow. Helps me out a great deal. But of course, with that, thank you all so much for watching. Catch you guys in the next video. Bye!